Wednesday afternoon midweek baseball between the Northwestern Wildcats and the Bradley Braves. Count even to the first baseman Sulka. The 2-2 swung on and missed. Strike three, and that's the end of the inning. Leg kicks, delivers. That pitch in there, called third strike. J.F. Garan can't believe it. And Yas trying to the third base dugout. It's the 1-2 home from Clay. Swung on and hit deep into left field. That ball into the gap, and it gets down. One hops the wall over the fence. A ground rule double for Jack Clay's as he put a charge into that one to the deep part of the park. Infield back for Bradley as the 0-1 swung on in line in left field, a base hit. Connor Lind will cross home plate. Jack Clays will not be sent. He's held at third. Willie Bourbon cashes in with an RBI single. Junior for the Braves. He swings through that pitch, and Davis first at bat, and he says goodbye. He's facing a two-strike count once again. Davis to the plate, and he swings through another one. It's Garan goes down swinging again. This would be a heck of an escape job, though. And Shadid swings through that one for strike three. Schindler prevents the Braves from getting any runs across. He steps into the plate. He has an RBI, and he drives that one deep to left field. That's over the left fielder. And, oh, it bounces off the glove of Gruner in left field. Two men score, and he's going for third, and he slides in ahead. There's cut off, and a huge play there from Jake Schieber as he Doubles the Wildcats' lead to 4 nothing. Pulled around with it. He dropped it a couple times out there. And Dickey threw the hole in the left side, and that'll be another RBI for him as coming around to score is Schieber. Signal winds and delivers the 2-2. Swung on, grounded to the shortstop, done. Flips to Bourbon for one. On to first, a double play. How about it? Tommy Bordignan and the Wildcats. Beat the only other private school with Division I baseball in the state of Illinois. A 5-1 victory for Northwestern over Bradley.